Welcome back everybody, Drin6 Away Plays. We're in the middle of a escort mission in the game Battletech. Uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, how what can far I do can for you, you glitch? You can get up to here. Couldn't have your face off that way. Moving out. And then fangs. You just need to get up here in front of them. I'm going to actually face off this way because I'm not really looking in that direction with anybody. And Behemoth. I really don't know where to put you, dear. Maybe up here? I don't know. Okay, Medusa. <sighs> I could run you up here. Could run you all the way up to here. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do with these people. I have no idea where the pirates are going to come from, so I don't know where to go hide. I want to be in some kind of cover. Maybe kind of run up here. Right? Kind of run up here and be in some cover and see if they're out on this end. I'll have him go check out this way. More or less. Location confirmed. Get up in that forest and see if they're coming from that way. Got to be coming from somewhere. Okay. They should be getting into the con into the. Looks like they're sending in reinforcements. Okay. You're in position, Commander. Hold your ground until the package is on its way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They drop. They dropped a locust. Is that all? Long range missile five, medium laser, long range missile five. It's got missiles. It's got way too many freaking missiles. Okay, he's got missiles. I need to take. What is that? Okay, Medusa. What can we do? Could you actually get on top of him and shoot him? Could melee him. What if I go melee him? I try melee him. Spot it. Oh, I should have probably tried to do the engaging. I punched him. I did something to him. That hit something good. Uh. Good to go. Well, you could move to here. Waiting for orders. Behemoth could move like to here. On my way. Uh, 
And then... Oh, not him. I don't want to shoot my guy. <laughs> what can I hit him with? These things can't hit, right? So I just shoot with what I've got. Just trying to do some damage to him. Took off one of his arms. That's one of his... Oh, they just... Target up for out. I can do an extract right now. No need to get out to our planned LZ. Okay, so we won. Mission successful. Okay, that was a whole lot faster than I thought it was going to be. I thought there was going to be a whole lot more to do there. Okay, so we continue. Should give us the after. Contractor paid by 10.20. Pay out 210. Uh, don't look like anybody got any damage. Got 500 experience points for everybody. I get to pick two things. Well, I do need jet. Let's see, I'm gonna get a total of Well, I could sell these, convert them into stuff. You have one of three. So if you take that, I know I can turn those things into Up to five additional pieces of salvage. One, two, three, four, five. All right. So I got everything anyway. Facing matters. Yeah. I messed that up a couple times. <laughs> Bro, I clicked too fast and all of a sudden I'd run up and be facing the wrong way. Couldn't even attack. Okay, so that goes out, comes back in two days, financial report in five, and I think, contracts wise, we only have, oh, what's this? This is a travel as well. Travel to Detroit, so they want me to go to Detroit for their two things. Should be another one of their escorts. And this would be putting us in between. Uh, both of these are on desert. No, this one's in tundra. Tundra I can use energy weapons in. This I can't. All right, let's take a quick look at our mech bays now. What do we got going on here? Uh, do I have damage again? No, okay. So nobody's got any damage. Uh, if I go into storage, parts, two of three. So, so I need to get another panther and then I'd be able to rebuild it, I guess. So when you get the partials, you gotta get the pieces. Okay. All right, I got it. Components, we got lots of components. So I wanna see what this one looks like. This is the locust. What do they already have? It has two machine guns, medium laser, and machine gun ammo. So I would wanna put One. 
Got lots of armor. Light fire support while well, a machine gun. That's not even 0 0.5. Tonnage 6? Wow! Wow, this is this tease feet. Light fire support is understatement. <laughs> More like insect fire support. It'll ping a little bit on their armor, tell them that you're there. Wow. I don't see a reason to ever use this. Okay. Well, that's just weird. A spider. Uh, let's take a look at our people. How many points do we have now? Uh, Medusa? Yeah. We've got 1,800. So I could put you in one of these. Gain one bonus evasion charge after moving. Can exceed the unit's maximum if the move is not a sprint. Jump or charge to melee. The mech also gains entrenched. 50% stability. That might be a thing to do. Uh, for fangs. Piloting. I think I just want to get myself up to fours and then I'll decide what I want to do here. I think for fangs we're going to go with uh, this stability thing. And then very likely a thing where I can fire my lasers at one and stuff like that. So I might go stability gunnery. Waiting on you, Commander. Rich, you can't really go anywhere. Neither yes, can Commander. she. She could get tactics. Which would help her called shots. Or I could save up to pick one of these other things. I'm not sure what to do with her. I think I'm gonna go ahead and take her, give her the, the mech warrior training complete. Yes, Commander. I'm just gonna line us up with fours and everything. Training complete. Everybody that can get a four is gonna get a four. Me too. Training confirmed, Commander. Okay. Waiting for orders. So now we're all ready to pick our specialties next orders. time around. Glitch already Good has her first one, which is this. Oh, she can get piloting. So let me give her piloting. Mech warrior training complete. So Glitch already has multi-targeting. And I'm going to have her, I think, go up this route. She's going to be shooting in this. Uh... Ready for this order. girl here, she's got the guts. She gives her the cart, the guarded, and all the extra covering damage. I think maybe I'll have her go. Maybe here. All right, Medusa. He's gonna take targeting and probably guts. You know the tactics and guts. And fangs. I'm gonna go probably. Piloting and shooting. And Decker's already got this, so I probably will give him either guts or piloting as well. Okay. He's got to get back in the game before then. Alright, that takes care of that. Uh... the store I should probably check what's our reputation now I really looked at our reputation we're up to 25 everybody's indifferent to us 
Minus 17, though, on the pirates. Minus 10 for the Torian Concordant. Minus 10 for the Capellians. Minus 5 to the Lyrians. Minus 5 to the Federated Sons. Minus 5 to the... Uh, uh, minuses, 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 and minuses. And minuses with everyone. Uh, okay. And the other things out there will get me in with minuses to manage a stream of cannabis. Okay. I guess I'm just going to have lots of enemies. But I am up to 25. Finances are actually probably pretty good right now. We're at 1.3 million, so I've got one, two, three, five. I've got five months in the bank for right now. Uh, these guys' are, salaries are going to go up. So, the only thing we have left to do is uh, contracts, right? We picked up a new contract here, which takes us to New Detroit. But our benefactor is here in Belfron, which is where we're at. Can't personally vouch for her, but she's rich and her credentials seem to check out. And we're, God, and that's where we're at is at Belfron, right? Yeah, we're at Belfron. So I think next time what we'll do is, uh, that's where, well, I'm at 16 minutes. Oh, Lord. Should we just go and see who this person is? Might have to put a cut in there before we go any farther. I'm worried that it's going to take me right into a mission. It doesn't look like I can actually contract. Uh, see, I don't get to do anything. All I can do is travel to Bellerophon to meet your new client. We are at Bellerophon. So should we just do this? This is supposed to advance the story. Let's advance the story. I've got a couple of nice things here that I think I'd like to try because it looks like I can get some decent salvage out of these things. Do another convoy one and then maybe go try to defend the repair base. Uh, let's go talk to our person here before we go off to Detroit. Go visit the lions. All right, well, let's go do this. We've got but about 12 minutes that we can do this in. Let's see what happens. So we're gonna go meet our mystery client. Uh, let's go, this is probably a bad idea. Benefactor, in orbit, Bellarifla. Anna Marie Centrella. Mr. Olivier, thank you for honoring my request to meet. I am Anna Marie Centrella. You heard of my family, family I'm sure. Hey, to try this is a surprise. I wouldn't expect a member of the Canopian royal family to even know who we are, let alone approach us in such a non-traditional manner. Okay. This isn't a traditional contract, and I don't need Comstar asking questions. Besides, there's no reason to involve the Mercenary Review Board. I already know that I want to hire you. I've Have I piqued your interest, Commander 608? Certainly, we wouldn't be here if you hadn't. Sounds like me. I'm pleased to hear it. The job I have for you is a relatively simple one. I need you to recover something for me, and I need it done quietly. In exchange for your services, I will pay down the interest on your rather sizable loans and buy you the breathing room you've been looking for. How do you know about... You know what? It doesn't matter. Just tell us what we're supposed to be recovering. <laughs> it's like, 
How do you know? Well, it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, that'd be me too. How do you know? Uh, never mind. You, just considering that you found us in the in the ether of space, not a problem. Let's tell us what we're supposed to be recovering. This. Ladies and Charles, the image is replaced on the screen by a grainy photograph of an enormous grounded dropship. Ramshackle structures cling to it like barnacles. Okay. She's a derelict of vessels and Argo, one of the only two ever made. For over 200 years, she's been lying in state on Axelis, a pirate moon in the heart of the frontier. I want her, and you are going to bring her to me. How exactly are we supposed to do that? I mean, that's a big ship, and she looks half cannibalized for parts. Look, you can see her ribs in the photo. I'm as enthusiastic about money as the next guy, but I'm a mech tech, not an aerospace engineer. Be damned if I can get that thing flying again. Good old Yang. Relax, Mr. Virton. I have engineering staff on hand to attend to the Argo. Their leader, Dr. Farad Murad, has built quite a reputation for herself on the frontier. You'll find a jump ship waiting for you at Alloway. It will carry you to the pirate moon, where you'll clear a path to the crash site. Dr. Marud and her team will go to work on the derelict, and you will protect them until the work is done. This should all be well within your capabilities, Commander 608, unless I've come to the wrong company, of course. Background for my Frontier fr Freelancer. You don't work on Frontier... Without learning how to deal with pirates, we can handle the job, no sweat. No sweat? Okay. So what I'm hearing is that you want us to play babysitter while a bunch of gearheads fix a ship. Sounds like a relatively straightforward job. It should be easily within our capability. Oh god, what do I say? Uh, should I use my background frontier of freelancer? No sweat? I, I shouldn't, don't think I should say that. It's on a moon, which means it's vacuum, which means I'll have to refit us to all sorts of projectiles. Things that don't have, like, lasers and stuff won't work. We learned that in the, one of the videos. There was a video I went through, like, all the menus that show you all the tutorial stuff. And one of the things is the environment. It's like vacuum environment or next to no environment is really, really bad. So I'd have to refit my mechs to be uh, using like projectile weapons and stuff because they don't generate as much heat as like lasers do and PPCs and stuff. Uh, you don't work on the frontier without leaving how to deal with pirates. We can handle the job, no sweat. What I'm hearing is that you want us to play babysitter while a bunch of gearheads fix a ship. Clear a path to the crash site. Dr. Murad and her team will go to work on the derelict, and you will protect them until the work is done. Well, within your capabilities, Commander 608, unless I've come to the wrong company, of course. Uh, kids? Why can't I talk to my associates before we accept? Well, I'm a little bit snarky. I mean, yeah, that's my background, Frontier Freelancer. You don't work on Frontier without learning how to deal with pirates. We can handle the job, no sweat. I think I'm going to go with the second one. So what I'm hearing is that you want us to play babysitter while a bunch of gearheads fix a ship. That's what I love about you mercenaries. You're so refreshingly straightforward. It appears that we do have an understanding. Do the job well enough, and there will be other opportunities awaiting upon your return. We'll never find you a better opportunity than the one I'm offering, Commander Zenith. I can promise you that. She's the wrong, Dredd. We're looking for a lifeline. I think it's as close as we're going to get. Do get a tree, but I don't see what choice we've got. 
Well, there's always a choice. In this case, we could take the job or we could accept a life of desper desperate, disparate, desperate poverty. So I guess that means we're in. <laughs> yeah. Very good. I've already contacted Mr. Oliver. Your reputation as a, as a freelancer is well known within the Magistry Commander 608. I hope that you will live up to it. So Anna Marie Centrella. Cover job is ready for review in the command center. We should follow up when you think we're ready. Okay. So now we got an official contract, right? So if I were to go... Yeah, that's bad. And it's a little higher priority. It's a little bit tougher difficulty rating. So I think we're going to do this ammunition convoy first. Travel to Alloway and dock with the jump ship you'll find waiting there. Okay, we need to go look at the star map and see where the hell this place is. Uh, what is that? Navigation. Okay. Uh, star map. Where the heck is Alloway? Uh, so what's this? Is that Alloway? No, that's Alloway. It's going to take us on a jump ship. This is Detroit. That's where we came from. That was our first three years later mission. Then we traveled to Belharn. We did this. Now they've got a couple contracts we can do here. Right? So I think we're going to travel to Detroit, do a couple things, and then we'll travel to Alloway because we'll have the money to travel. <coughs> <coughs> Dear. Excuse me. So... Climate Tarrant. So that's going to be just sort of mixed, right? Agriculture, aquatic, chemicals, medium gravity, modern population, periphery level, civilization, Tarrant world. Okay. All right, we don't want to do that. Let's get out of there. All right, so uh, when we come back next time, I am going to actually take uh, this ammunition convoy uh, thing. I'm going to set up our... We're going to a tundra. That's going to be Badlands. So I think I'm going to play around and maybe rearrange my, uh, my mechs. Some of their armament stuff. Try something a little different than what I've got and see what I can come up with before we go, and then we will go do this ammunition convoy next time. All right? All right. If you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. You really like to see, go ahead and subscribe, and notify bell. you notified, upload videos under scheduled streams. Uh, I'm Dren608. Until we meet again, stay safe, and bye-bye.